Spinach isn't just an excellent source of vitamins A, C, and K, it may also reduce hunger and cravings, according to a study published in the Journal of the American College of Nutrition. It found that compounds in the photosynthesis cells of spinach promote the release of satiety hormones. Preliminary research published in Cell found out that spinach might make your muscles more efficient during a workout. In the study, participants who took a small dose of inorganic nitrate an amount equivalent to what's found in a plate of spinach for three days consumed less oxygen while riding an exercise bike. That improved performance is thanks to the increased efficiency of mitochondria, which power our body's cells. In an Oregon State University study, researchers discovered cooked meat can produce a cancer-causing carcinogen, which can damage microRNA in the human body. But unlike DNA, which is permanently damaged when mutations alter it, microRNA can be restored to normal cell function via healthy lifestyle choices and diet. This is where our leafy superfood comes into play. Spinach consumption can partially offset the damaging effects of cancer-causing carcinogens. In the study, spinach consumption nearly have the incidence of colon tumors from 58% to 32% in laboratory animals. Spinach is a rich source of vitamin K, which helps in promoting the production of a protein called osteocalcin. Osteocalcin is responsible for stabilizing calcium in the bones. In addition to being rich in vitamin K, spinach is also a great source of calcium and vitamin D, dietary fiber, potassium, magnesium, and vitamin C. All of which are important nutrients that are good for bone health. Spinach contains beta-carotene, zeaxanthin, lutein, and chlorophyll, all of which are responsible for improving your eyesight and boosting your immune system. Lutein and zeaxanthin are stored in the macula, which is a part of the retina that acts as a natural sunblock, shielding your eye from damaging light. This will also help lower the risk of macular degeneration, which is why most people are advised to eat more and more spinach. <laughs>